Hi Carol and happy birthday. I made you this handmade journal for your birthday and I thought it might be handy if I explained some of it because this is a pretty unique journal that I made. So on the front cover is a piece of French. It's a French um, textbook from 1940. In this journal, you can write anywhere there's blank spaces. So you can even write on this journal paper here. It's old ledger paper. Right here is a pocket and I have put a copy of the postcard you sent me when you were in Cannes. Sorry if I butchered the pronunciation. And on here, this is um, a journaling tag and you can even write on the back of it. So anywhere there's like a pocket with a journal tag, you can write journaling on there, like secret journaling that you don't want people to see easily. And you can slide it right in the pocket. This paper here I made my with coffee dyed paper. This book here, this is a copy of an old book that I found, I think it's from the 1920s. And you can journal on the two inside pages. Right here is an envelope that I made. And if you want to save anything or write any journaling um, that you don't want someone to see, you can slide it in and close it up. This, um, this page is from a children's book from, I think, the 30s. Here's another copy of the postcard you sent me. This is music copied on the coffee dyed paper. And here's some more journaling spots for you, secret journaling spots. And this is an old cancel check from 1922, but it's just a copy of it. So you can even write on the back of it if you want to. Here's another journaling spot. A little journaling pocket that I made. You can write on those, both sides. You can also tuck some pictures or memorabilia or anything that you'd want to save. This one comes out too. This is a coffee dyed paper and I put a piece of old lace on the edge. Here's some more um, journaling boxes. I kind of thought if you had something longer you could write, you could write on here, you could write on both sides. And right here is washi tape, it's called. You can use the washi tape. Um, you can peel it off. It's like masking tape. If you want to tape anything more into your journal. And this is a copy of a postcard, but I just copied the front. Here's another piece of that French textbook. And right back here is some more um, things I just thought were cute that might go well in the journal. You could put them anywhere you wanted in the journal, or you could just keep them like this. So cute picture of a dog, coffee dyed paper, music paper, another old check, 
just a piece of paper in case you wanted to cut it and put a picture on it and then for like scrapbooking I just really like this heart paper and this paper here is Tomoe River paper and I dyed it with avocado dye it's a light pink And this is called a belly band, so you can just slide everything under the belly band. And that's the end. So feel free to use this however you want. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you time, take time to look at all the special things I've tucked in here for you. Hope you have a great day. Bye.